if you want to upgrade your pc hard disk to ssd and then you don't want to lose any file settings or windows activation or anything else that on your previous windows you don't want to lose so how you are going to do so this video will helps you how you can clone your hard disk to ssd or clone hard disk to hard disk how you are going to same pc clone to a different pc or same pc you just change the windows to the another hard disk so i will show you step by step how you are going to do these things and then without paid software that one is simple and easy method that you can do it by yourself so before we continue if you are new in my channel please don't forget to subscribe my channel press the bell icon for the new update so let's begin to our topic okay friends so first of all you need to open the google chrome and then type there easy u e f i and then click enter so you can see here the first link is uefi.com click that one and then after that opening you can see here the utilities you click the utilities and then you can see the disk clone so we click the disk clone so now you can see here the download completely free it's totally free so you download it in your computer first before you are doing the uh, fixing your hard disk or uh, fi fixing your ssd on your pc so download first before you insert your hard drive okay friends so i already downloaded so i just install in my pc click yes select your language accept the terms and conditions agreement and then next next and then if you want to create your uh, desktop icon desktop shortcut you can click next and install so once program installing on your pc you can select the launch i am not going to launch because i haven't fixed the hard disk so i just uh, uncheck this box launch uh, and then click finish so our software is done ready so now what we need to do we just off our shut down our pc okay friends so we already shut down this pc now we are going to open to fix our hard drive or ssd so we open the cover then you can see here this one is the primary hard disk and then we are going to add another hard drive to copy our system files windows and then all the settings file all everything you can use here the ssd to copy or you can use the hard disk so i have available this hard drive so i am using this hard drive but make sure the the size of the hard drive you are going to fix not less than the primary hard disk because uh, once the less than this hard drive you cannot uh, complete your procedure to uh, complete this step the windows and all your files and settings on the another hard drive because we are going to run this hard drive on the same pc because uh, after that we are going to run run this same hard drive on the this pc because sometimes this hard disk is failure so we can uh, fix back our this hard drive to return our all the uh, windows settings and then same windows and then windows license and then settings and then all everything we can return back on this hard drive so we just fixed first so we turn on this pc and then see on the screen 
okay friends so now we are in the screen we click the my computer and then click the manage so we enter the disk management so we can check the our hard drive is fixed proper or no so we just check the our hard drive first and before the proceed the file cloning so we click the disk management now as you can see this one is our second hard drive 2 terabyte you can see here the 2 terabyte so our hard drive is already fixed and then this one is our system hard disk you can see the windows c is 472 gigabytes and data this one is the another partition that i keep my data something so we just close this one and then open the hard drive cloning so we open the software we downloaded that one now here you can see the you can you have three options that partition clone if you want to partition one by one clone it's up to you and then if you want to uh, disk clone also can because uh, you can choose by yourself but I'm going to uh, clone the system so I'm going to copy all the windows and settings and then the windows license all everything so I just select the system clone once I select the system clone you can see the different menu appears on our screen that one is the separate in the uh, partitions now you can see here this one is the our disk we fix you can see here the 1.82 terabyte and then this one is the uh, system disk you can see here the dynamic disk so this one is the our system you can see here the automatically selected by the system and then you can see here that this one is the system disk and then windows this two partition is already selected by the this software and then this one is the our hard drive so uh, we no need to change anything if we want to system clone so we just click the next now here is asking the please select the location you want to clone so this one is the our uh, hard drive the our uh, location of the clone or migration so I selected the hard disk and then you can see here the clone is MBR or uh, keep partition layout. So I just select the keep partition layout and then click the next. So I no need to uh, clone as a MBR. So I just click uh, next. Now you can see here this one is the automatically uh, this one is the dynamic the system disk it's automatically uh, separated the system files and then our hard drive is here so we can click the proceed once we click the proceed you can see here the notification that our hard drive we fix that we will lose our data if there is any data so if you want to continue or no so we just click the yes so because uh, we want to format the hard disk to clone our system so select yes now our system is cloning in the progressor so it take maybe several minutes or one hour it depends on your data so we just wait and then continue Okay friends, so now as you can see on the screen our operation completed successfully. So now the hard disk is ready to transfer in computer. So we take out the original hard drive and then put this one and then let's try. So we can check our files and then windows all everything and then settings all transfer already or not so let's go to the computer
okay friends so now you can see this one is we already copy and then this one is the original system hard drive so what we do we just take out the cable for the testing I just take out the power cable so now we try to on the PC so we can check this hard drive is uh, working or no or how the our files is copy properly or not so let's go to the screen and then check this hard drive so our hard drive is working properly you can see the now windows is running so it means to say the windows copy properly let's wait until the process so now as you can see our windows is started ready let's see if there is asking the pin because the previous is i put the pin so it's successfully the asking the pin so our windows is same as my previous pc let's see how the inside so you can see even the profile desktop picture also it's same so hope everything going to same wow wonderful the all the settings all the files even in the file on the desktop all it's same you can see on the hard drive this one is the running and then the system i already take out this one is the oh, system cable i take out so now this hard disk is running so you can change also your hard drive uh, to ssd or change the same clone pc or migrate your pc uh, successfully by using this software to free clone your hard drive to ssd or system clone so hope this video is going to helpful for you if you like this video don't forget to thumbs up please subscribe my channel press the bell icon for the new updates thank you